race six of the 2021 UCI Women's World Tour, and we stay in Northern Europe, in the Netherlands, for Amstel Gold Race Ladies Edition, and a very early morning start for the great and good of the women's peloton. With the COVID-19 pandemic making the 2020 event impossible, it was good to be back in Limburg, even if the 116.3 kilometre route was changed to run over seven laps of a very intense circuit. After 90 kilometres of constant attacking and reforming in the peloton, two riders descended into Valkenburg inside the closing 20 kilometres with a decent lead. Live Racing's Paulina Royakers and the winner of the Oxyclean Classic Brugge de Panna Grace Brown of Bike Exchange, entered the final lap together. But with the Dutch rider dropped on the descent towards the final climb of the Gulemeberg, the Australian was left to forge on alone. And it was only the power of Trek Segafredo's Lucinda Brand that brought her within touching distance of a reduced bunch of around 20 women. But Brown was still leading inside the final two and a half kilometers and took the turn into the final ascent of the Kalberg at the head of the race. But as she accelerated to take on the punishing gradients, European champion and Tour of Flanders winner Annemiek van Vleuten overtook in a bid for victory. Behind her, defending champion Cassia Niviadoma ground her way up to the leader, overtaking and going clear. UCI Women's World Tour overall leader Elisa Longo Borghini struggling to close the gap to the Polish rider's wheel. The Italian caught the leader and attacked as the race entered the final 1,000 metres, gapping her rival though Nivia Doma fought back. But as she caught Longo Borghini, the chasers were closing in. Ashley Moulman Passio doing all the work and cooperation between the two champions at the front disappeared, each looking at the other. 600 meters to go and the gap was almost gone and we were set for a 10 woman sprint for victory. 300 meters and they were caught as the chasers lined themselves up for the final effort. Mariana Voss opened up first and got a gap, but Demi Vollering was closing in. But it was Voss who kept her head down, crossing the line with just enough time to celebrate a famous success, adding Amstel Gold Race to a very long list of fabulous race successes and taking the lead of the UCI Women's World Tour standings. <laughs> Voss crossed the line just ahead of an on-form Demi Vollering, Annemiek van Vleuten finishing a close third after her attack at the bottom of the climb. Amanda Spratt was fourth, with Longo Borghini and Nivia Doma taking eighth and tenth place respectively. Race winner Mariana Voss now leads the UCI Women's World Tour overall classification, taking Elisa Longoborghini's place in the purple Santini jersey. Annemiek van Vleuten moves into third place, while Grace Brown drops to fourth. 
Emma Jurgensen continues to top the UCI Women's World Tour Young Rider table, with Maria Novolodskaya in second, and an extremely aggressive performance from Neve Fisher-Black taking her to third.